Yeah, hi, Sharon Jesus. Yeah, it was a real hard day today um, at the mission. You know, the, the the young ones that come in and stuff like that, that uh, they just can't get the world out of their head and that, and they walked off property. And it was like God was speaking to me in the spirit, and he says, how bad do you want me? How bad do you want me? Because I want you so much. You know, and, and, and it just hurts my soul and stuff because I, I truly love the mission, the mission teens and where I'm at, Sunrise Mission. And it caused me to write, uh, come to Sunrise Mission. Because this is where I found the Holy Spirit. I've been here now four years and I just love what God's doing in my life. God, you placed me in your mission to learn the true word of God. Placed your Holy Spirit in me. I am is our God. I will protect you from the storms out in the sea. This sanctuary, Sunrise Mission, is the house of God. The devil can't touch you or me. Because we're covered in the blood of Jesus. His angels guard the door. I've placed my power in you. See the plans I have in store. Come to Sunrise Mission. I have great plans for you. My spirit wants to lead you, your mind in Christ renew. Just last week I saw God's protection. When Hurricane Irma came around Florida and took a beating at Sunrise Mission, trees bounced off the building and hit the ground. We were protected by the water as though God parted the Red Sea. You are my children. I, I'll protect you. I need you for my ministry. God, you are so majestic. I am my God. You are. Your presence at the mission is always near, not far. Your present in my directors, Victor and Mary and Adair. You just see the signs of God in the staff and residents who live there. As you grow further in mission teens, God will trust you with more. To feel God's beauty during praise and worship time. God's blessing on his flow through that door. It's time to spend with Jesus Time to read and learn God's word. Spend time with Jesus, write in spirit what you heard. Come to Sunrise Mission, I have great plans for you. My spirit wants to lead you, your mind in Christ renew. Yeah, I, I found this, it was written in September 13th, 2017, when we <laughs> had Hurricane Irma, and like I said, the wind and that came, and you know, this is God's protection. There's so much spirit there. And then when I see residents leave and stuff and not understand that, you know, it's like God saying, don't, why are you walking back out in the world? I got you where I want you. I got you in my sanctuary. Let me fill you up with the word. And and I'll bring teachers in five and a half hours a day. We'll, I'll teach you what praise and worship is all about. How much do you want me, God asks us. I want you so much. I'd, I'd go to Calvary and I'd suffer and I'd die. And then it come to come to me. How much do you want me? Well, as you go through the day, pray for our brothers and sisters to... You know, in the mission and stuff, it's uh, it breaks my heart to see others, you know, walk away and and don't understand how much God loves them. Uh,